I'm gonna read this thing. Yeah, yeah, me too. All right. We want to let you know that Jeff Kaplan has decided to leave the company after a long and storied career here. That, and here, and uh, Aaron Keller, a Blizzard veteran and founding member of the Overwatch team, will be stepping in as game director. Aaron has been a critical part of the Overwatch team and a key driver in creating the vision for the game. He helped create Overwatch as an original member of the team. And as an 18-year veteran at Blizzard, he has worked side-by-side -side with Jeff for a long time. Not only in building Overwatch, but previously in helping to build WoW as well. A few words from Aaron. You know, it's funny. I've always remembered Jeff trying to, like, communicate with the, the, the public more. And I feel like in the last year, we haven't, like, seen him or heard from him that often. And part of that, I think, might have been, or at least a lot, most people probably thought was COVID. Was like, you know, oh, like, it's just tougher. Like... We got like one or two updates from him, you know? We didn't really get that many. I wonder if it's something changed in the within the company that they're not allowed to do it as often anymore. Or he just didn't want to anymore. He was just fucking sick of it. And honestly, I don't blame him. Fucking this community fucking was just mean to him all the time. Yeah, they were nice to him at the same time, but there were times of fucking just mean, dude. Greetings, Overwatch community. Jeff has been a great leader, mentor, and friend. And knows how much we're going to miss him. I've been lucky to work alongside him and the rest of the Overwatch team for many years in building something that continues to inspire people all around the world. And I'm honored to carry the torch forward. So this is uh, Aaron talking. I love Overwatch. From our first pieces of concept art to our first maps we built to the first time I was able to run around his tracer. Two games from Masters Pogus Champion. Who at the early point shot laser beams out of her eyes. The game, this game has just clicked with me. I love its inspiring, hopeful, beautiful world worth fighting for. I love its characters, larger than life, colorful, powerful, and global. And most of all, I love the fast, fluid gameplay requiring teamwork, situation awareness, and quick decision making. I also recognize that making games at Blizzard has always been a group effort and never about just one point of view. Interesting. Together with the rest of the team, I feel fortunate to have a deep branch of sorry a deep bench of de development and creative leaders numerous veteran blizzard artists and designers and some extremely talented new blood as well along with tons of support throughout the company for the live game and for overwatch 2 speaking of overwatch 2 development is continuing at a good pace we have an exceptional vision we are executing on the reaction from many of you at, to the updates we shared at blizzcon thrilled us and we have exciting re reveals planned for this year and beyond as we ramp up to launch we'll be sharing more frequent updates about overwatch 2 progress and new features in the live game with all of you very soon while i have no pretenses about filling jeff's shoes i'm excited to step into the game director role and continue to be a part of the team putting all of its hard talent and focus into the next iteration of overwatch i'm honored to continue serving this incredible community aaron we are all, we we're also tremendously grateful for Jeff's contributions over the years. Please see a personal note from Jeff below. I am leaving Blizzard Entertainment after 19 amazing years. It was truly an honor of a lifetime to have the opportunity to create worlds and heroes for such a passionate audience. I want to express my deepest appreciation for everyone at Blizzard who supported our games, our teams, and our players. But I want to say a special thanks to the wonderful game developers that shared in the journey of the creation with me. Never accept the world as it appears to be. Always dare to see what it could be. I always hope you do the same. GG Jeff Kaplan. We'll be hearing more from Aaron and the rest of the Overwatch team soon. In the meantime, please join us in thanking Jeff and welcoming Aaron to his new role. If I had glasses, I'd take him off right now. We were told at BlizzCon that in March or April we would get developments and updates about Overwatch 2. That's what they're probably referencing and saying he's showing you stuff soon. Jeff worked on some of the best games in Overwatch. With WoW and Burning Crusade and making a lot of those games like top tier. Jeff knows his stuff. And with Overwatch 2 being obviously delayed so much. What happened to my letter? 
What happened to my letter? You think you got my letter, chat? You think you got my letter? Wait, is there? This is the IGN one too. Is this different? Fuck, this is different. Okay. <sighs> Jeff Kaplan, the director of Overwatch, has announced he's leaving Blizzard Entertainment after nearly 20 years of the company. Personal message, Kaplan. Okay, I read that. Development on Overwatch 2 will continue in with assistant game developer Aaron Keller taking over as a new director on the sequel. Keller previously worked with Kaplan on World of Warcraft. Jeff is a great leader, mentor, and friend, and knows how much we're going to miss him. Keller writes a letter to the community. I've been so lucky working alongside. Okay. I went to in 2002, started as an engineer of World of Warcraft, developing quests and upcoming going MMORPG and eventually was credited with a game direction on WoW in 2009 Kaplan and Spear had an unannounced project at Blizzard called Titan a first person shooter unfortunately Titan never came together and it was officially cancelled in 2014 however Kaplan and the members of Titan took ideas from the game and redesigned them a team based hero shooter known as Overwatch Overwatch has been incredibly successful since, successful since launch with over 50 million players and numerous game of the year awards Overwatch has helped reinvigorate the hero shooter genre Overwatch has also spawned off its own dedicated esports series called the Overwatch League, which spearheaded city-based teams mirroring traditional sports leagues. Blizzard is also announcing the sequel of Overwatch 2, game designed to introduce a single-player component that fleshes out the Blood Heroes of Overwatch through the new PvP maps, and heroes will still be released through, for both Overwatch... Wait. Through new PvP maps and heroes will still be released for both Overwatch 1 and 2. That's not true. We're not getting any new maps or any new heroes. So there goes that. Um, that's the other. Fuck. Oh my god. This is this is the worst thing. Dude. I actually cannot think of worse news that could have came out of Overwatch 2. I, I, I'm, in, I'm inclined to agree because I've worked in big PR companies. And this is very PR-like because the new guy got all this big paragraph and Jeff got a sentence, a small, and a sentence. And it was an honor of the lifetime to have the opportunity to create worlds and heroes for such a passionate audience. I want to express my deep appreciation to everyone at Blizzard who supported our games. Very, that is very, 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 you know, our game teams and our players. But I just want to say special thanks to all the wonderful game developers that shared our journey. I feel like this is like him saying like thanks to the team. I guess thanks for working there. But this is like, I don't know. Like maybe I'm overthinking this. I mean, there's no big thanks to the community. Like the players, yeah. But like I don't know, like. To be honest, the community shit on him all the time, like, and just fucking yelled at him, so I wouldn't, th I wouldn't fucking exploit, I just wouldn't, I wouldn't, you know, I wouldn't probably say anything either, but, diamond four, fuck, I'm gold. Alrighty, well, ready to the, ready to the, ready to the game? Uh. One of the path comes here, by the way. What's up? I don't think the patch went through. It didn't go through? No, I don't think so. At least not right now. Yeah, it probably was probably not coming out today then. Yeah. Probably will come out Thursday or Wednesday. Maybe, yeah. Uh... Yep. Well, that's awful. Yeah, that's it. Nice. We don't have to be a negative Nancy's, but it life goes on its business. That's not... That's really bad take. Really bad take. You're talking about something that's a creative design. Let's say Retro came in, okay? Let's say Retro came in and took over my stream. I got fired from the stream and Retro took over. I love Retro, but would Retro be the same streamer as me? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Even though he's learned tons from me, he knows all my tricks, my secrets, what ways I interact with chat, memes for videos, etc. It would not be the same stream. Jeff didn't create Overwatch in the same way you created this stream. Jeff is part of the original design team and had 10 years of experience, actually 15 years of experience before that, it was part of the directive of the lead of Titan, when Titan was the original thing before Overwatch and had all the experience from that, then brought it into Overwatch and created Overwatch as the lead director of the team and was the lead director on the next game. 
you literally don't have anyone else that like you almost almost nobody that has the same type of experience and the same type of vision as that it will not go the same direction it is physically impossible so traveling to Volskaya Industries Prepare again to attack. select your hero I'm no game director so I don't honestly know how everything goes obviously but still Oh, great. 